Hello everyone, welcome to solve this nice algebra problem and here we have square root of m plus square root of m minus 9 is equals to 9 and we solve this problem for the values of m. So here the very first step we are going to do is here first we move this plus square root of m to the right hand side and it is written as square root of m minus 9 equals to 9 minus square root of m. So now here our first target is to uh, eliminate this square root sign on both of these terms then we easily find the values of m so that here first we need to take the squaring on both of the sides. So when we take squaring on both of the sides it is written as square root of m minus 9 and its whole square equals to 9 minus square root of m and its whole square. So here in the left hand side you see that these two and square root are gone and we get here m minus 9 and now in the right hand side here we use the nice square identity and you know about this identity if we have a minus b whole square it is equals to a square minus 2 times of a b plus b square. So here we use this nice formula to the right hand side of the above equation uh, so that our above equation is written as after applying this formula so our a is 9 so we write it as 9 square minus 2 times of a b so uh, our a is 9 and b is square root of m and b square so b is uh, square root of m and its whole square so uh, now uh, further in the next step uh, we need some simplification so this step is written as uh, here m minus 9 is equals to we know that 9 square is equals to 81 and this is 2 times of 9 is 18 into square root of m and this 2 and square root are gone and we get here plus m. And now uh, you see here uh, this plus m is cancelled out by this plus m uh, and uh, we obtain the remaining terms are minus 9 equals to 81 minus 18 into square root of m. So here we move uh, this uh, uh, this minus 18 into square root of m in the right hand side and we move this minus 9 in the uh, uh, we move this minus 18 into square root of m in the left hand side and minus 9 to the right hand side so after interchanging these values we write it as 18 into square root of m is equals to 81 plus 9 so uh, after interchanging these values we have 81 plus 9 becomes 90 and here you have 18 into square root of m. So now in the next step we move this 18 to the uh, right hand side or now we divide uh, both of the sides uh, by 18. Okay because here our target is to find the value of m. So that uh, we divide both of the sides by 18. So we write this in this form 18 into square root of m divided by 18 is equals to 90 is divided by 18. So here you see that this 18 and this 18 are cancelled by each other and we get here square root of m is equals to so here we cancel these terms 19 by 80 we cancel this term uh, by the table of 3 so we know that 3 6 is 18 and here you have 3 3 is 9 and 0 and here you have 6 5 is 30. So after cancellation uh, we have a square root of m is equals to 5. So because we solve this problem for the values of m here we again need to uh, cancel this square root so that now we again uh, taking uh, squaring on both of the sides okay so uh, when we taking squaring on both of the sides it is written as in this form 
uh, so square root of m and its whole square equals to 5 square uh, so this 2 and square root are gone and we get here our m is equals to 25 so we uh, this is the our final answer of this question and now we verify over this final answer is this value of m is satisfied over given question statement or not okay so uh, to check this value uh, here we need to first copy down the given question statement and it is square root of m plus uh, square root of m minus 9 is equals to 9 so here we substitute the value of m on, on the in the left hand side so you see here this is uh, 25 square root and plus 25 minus 9 square root and here we check is this equals to 9 or not okay so now we uh, need to simplify uh, the left hand side so after simplification uh, here we know that the square root of 25 is equals to 5 and plus 25 minus 9 is equals to 16 square root and this is equals to 9 and we check is this equals to 9 okay so uh, we know about the square root of 16 uh, the square root of 16 is equals to 4 and here we check this is equals to 9 or not so 5 plus 4 is 9 is equals to 9 so this shows that left hand side is equals to right hand side so the value of m equals to 25 is satisfied over this given equation so uh, this is the our final answer of this question uh, and uh, thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe uh, to my channel for more uh, this type of exciting videos okay